how, how do you all... I don't want to start this. Um, wait, how do I start? Uh, well, I'm going to start off with that. Hi, guys. Um, and then I'm going to start it off. Check this out. Um, how do I feel about this? I'm not too... I'm, I'm not happy about the reason why I'm not happy about this is because it's going to be one of two things. Either it's going to be very Battlefield 1-ish Unreal Engine or it's going to be very Escape from Tarkov -ish. Um, I don't want I play Escape from Tarkov as you know um And the problems that Escape from Tarkov has is the problems that heroes and generals have is map sucked, what AI sucked. Just Overall direction, retro game. Nice. I understand that they had a precise idea of what they were, and I also understand that that clear, concise idea failed. What also was the downfall was the tank update. My honest opinion. I did patch the game, I did play the game, and I tried it, and I hated it. The fact that I apparently ammo racked an M16, uh, an M18 Hellcat six or seven times, and the tank is still firing. The tank is still functional. I'm sorry, if I've ammo racked a tank, it doesn't just sit there, it goes kaboom and blows into pieces. Um... A lot of us, a lot of us streamers, um, myself included, we we stopped playing heroes in general when it was clear that the developers weren't listening, especially influencers like myself, Cotton, uh, I'm a Flying Cow, um, I Waxy. Oh God, that's. Um, and it was great that they were supporting us by giving us gold codes to give away to our, our players and our fans. But, at the same time, my biggest fear is that this New Heroes and Generals uh, a direct cut and paste of uh, of uh, that Gaijin shooter, um, in, not, um, enlisted, brain fog. Um, that's either gonna be too enlisted y slash, um, Red Orchestra, or it's gonna be too battlefield. That there's two spec sides of spectrum here. This is why a lot of people say if you want to play, have a fun military game. Play Call of Duty. If you want a hardcore uh, military shooter game, play uh, games like Escape from Time, which is true. So how are they going to balance heroes and generals? And another thing, adding the Russian faction in, but not giving Germany allied faction. The fact that they didn't add the British or the Japanese didn't make sense, or the Italians didn't make sense it wasn't just germany was the main bad guy italy was a bad guy vici france yes even certain french a okay, vici france french were also pro nazi there was uh, 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 th th there still even is to this day certain parts of of 
uh, Scotland and Ireland, who declared neutrality, which is horseshit, um, were also uh, 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 pro pro Nazi, but they weren't added in the game. You could have added the Sten submachine gun, but you could had you added the Webley, you could have added the Webley pistol, but you didn't. You could have added the Spitfire, but you didn't. You could have added the uh, uh, Cromwell, but you didn't. You could have added. There are so many things that you could have added into the game. You didn't. Dedicated tech tree branches. Okay. Is your tanker a light tanker? Okay, so you take your light tanker and you now put him in a heavy tank. Heavy tanks don't move like light tanks. Heavy tanks don't fire like light tanks. This is why when a tanker, a tank driver, or a TC, a tank commander, a loader, a radio operator, a gunner, a, a co-driver, you know, when that unit, again, ex-tank driver here, when that unit trains with a specific, specific tank, fine, mediums, frontline battle, main battle tanks, heavy tanks, light tanks, tank destroyers, it, those are all gone now. It's only just a, a main battle tank. Got the Challenger, the Abrams, the Leopard, and whatever Russia's spurting out. T, object, blah, 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 blah. Okay. That, that's, that's all you've got. In World War II, there were specific tanks for specific roles. Like recon, light tanks, medium tanks, heavy tanks, tank destroyers, artillery. Okay. Artillery was under army ordnance. Technically, that's part of the ground force. It wasn't. But point is, to, for simplicity's sake, okay, recon vehicles, yes, they were, again, part of the infantry, but they were also their own vehicle types. So uh, M5 Stuarts, uh, M8 Greyhounds. Um, uh, the Germans had the uh, 222. They had um, side cattle. Uh, they, they had uh, motorbikes. They had, there was, there was tons that you could have added. Tons. There was even a Panzer II. It was retrofitted scalps. Another thing that TLM Games, the new the new owners of, 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 of Heroes and Generals IV, please, for the love of God, allow recons to get experience by actually painting a target and allies killing it. Case in point, if I may recon, my job is to recon. It is reconnaissance. It is to be the eyes and ears of an army. It is to say, boop, heavy tank here. Boop, an aircraft gun here. Boop. Why can't games get a recon roll correct? They assume it, 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 it's enemy at the gates and I'm fucking Vizili Zaitsev. Eh, wrong. Got scout recon, okay. Keyword scout. Their job is not to primarily engage. It is to literally go. There's a tank. There's a column. There's infantry. There's this. There's that. And then pick and choose what targets they can to har harass the enemy, to cause en chaos within the enemy lines, but also to mark it so that other tanks and other fucking you. Pardon my French. Other units can actually do the job that we're, they, they were tailored to do. Case in point, if I'm a recon, okay, and our Hellcat's on the map, you don't think I'm going to go, dit, 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 dit. Oh, it's me, Batman. Do that tank, kill it. Of course I'm going to do that. I can't kill a bloody tank with a bolt action rifle. It, I'm literally going to go, Panzer four right there. Or T-34 right there, so that the Hellcat can go, okay, gotcha, boom. Oh, I believe I can fly. And then that way it's like, I gained 50% of the EXP and credits that that Hellcat just did. Why? Because I'm doing my job as a recon. That was the one function I always wanted. And you even added assisted EXP into the game. But then you added that caveat of you had to have at least damaged 
the, 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 the infantry, the vehicle, whatever. I'm a recon. I've got a car 98. What am I going to do to that bloody tank? Scrape its paint? Shoot out a fucking headlight? What, you, you gonna give Scout Recons freaking uh, Panzer Producers or, or, or freaking, uh, you know, German anti-tank gu anti guns? Are you gonna specifically say, okay, Scout Recon leads into Recon, leads into anti-tank, leads into, you know, have like a tech tree branch like most actual games do, like, like War Thunder, World of Tanks and stuff like that? That would be good because that means I can literally go, okay, today I'm gonna play infantry specific specifications medic or uh, 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 anti-tank gunner or whatever and just like in battlefield those weapons specific weapons and gear is locked to that tech tree that would be good and i'm sorry but that would that would be good get rid of the boosters get rid of the freaking oh boost your ribbons for this no 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 no, no, no. It's clear that you are not going to make the game free to play, especially if you've thrown it up on a Kickstarter. Okay? The fact that you literally put it up as a Kickstarter tells me you're going to be craving funds. Okay? So do yourself a favor, TLM. Right? Do not add a cash shop. I beg of you. Don't add one. Don't add one. Don't add one. You can add a battle pass. You can add so many other things. You do not need to add a cash shop. Just don't. Honestly, to me, do, do the World of Tanks model. Have a basic account and a premium account. Okay? What do premium accounts get? Extra EXP and credits. What else does a premium account get? Um, I don't know. Just thinking, e extra EXP and credits and maybe uh, a special banner to put next to their name, like I support so-and-so. Or, or better yet, you know, allow it to have access to premium gear. Like, Preset, pre-modded gear that they cannot modify. Okay, so if we're going to go back to the old heroes and generals, okay, let, let's go back to the old heroes and generals where you be able to modify your guns and your gear and stuff. Oh, cool. How about you add like a gold set locked item in the game? It's not max level, it's just tailored and for one specific role. Okay, so no amount of modding, no amount of leveling, no amount of custom skins or whatever. No, 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 no. It is locked. Okay? And you sell those premium weapons in game. Or a premium tank or a premium skin. Stuff like that. You know, stuff that doesn't exactly uh uh you know you could even do the the um Um, where you just have a skin shop. Where you can have, like, I don't know, uh, Africa Corps 1941. For your German name. Or uh, winter camo. Your tanks and stuff like that. Different unit badges. Like what, like what War Thunder does. It makes sense to do it like that. Do it like uh, uh, 1942. That was a really good game. I, I played in the beta of that. I'm an alpha player of Heroes and Generals. I quit playing. I truthfully quit playing Heroes and Generals. That was the when you play it, basically. Scream the loudest. 
motion. Just makes sense. And that's another thing. Don't just go to your nearest World War II museum. Like what Reto did. They went to their own museums in their own country. Which had limited gear. More than one war museum. If you're in England, go to the Imperial War Museum. Go to, go, uh, go to um, Boddington Tank Museum. But there are tons of museums. And they're free, I might add. Look up schematics and blue. They're available. Now I'm not saying make the make make Hellcats one shot kills or, or, or tanks one shot kills or anything. Balance the game out however you want. All I'm saying, TL. Okay, all I'm saying. I beg of you. All I am saying, TLM. stream yes i there's a high chance i there's even a high chance i will even back this high chance i will back you start slightly unreal smooth has a few shoes has a few shoes that code but Till then, guys.